Today, I am getting ready to do the 100 figure challenge. This challenge has been dragging on for me because of that I knew I had to do something. So I made it my goal to finish it. 70 figures in three days, all while working a full-time job, taking care of my pets, and of course, my daily responsibilities. Initially, my goal was just to finish 100 figures. However, due to problems with losing footage on my previous camera, I only had three figures done in a matter of two weeks, and I really needed to finish this. Not just for this challenge, but for me. So I made it my goal to finish the rest of the 70 figures in three days, all while filming on my phone. to finish these figures in these three days because during the weekend I would be going to Seattle with my boyfriend and to let it drag out longer than that would just be torture. So in order to time everything just right I would have to spend roughly five minutes on each figure with one minute to choose each figure that I did. to make the most of this opportunity to draw all these figures by doing as many different body types as I could from as many different ethnicities as I could and to try to my best to do an equal amount of male and female bodies. Hello, if I'm looking a little tired, a little bit haggard, it's because I am. It is 6.30 a.m. in the morning. I got up at four so that I can get a good dent done in this challenge before I go to work today. I was expecting to get a lot further than I did, but I had some technical issues. Just a lot of, because I'm filming on my phone, a lot of the issues I had had to do with file management and, you know, just taking care of the pets this morning and uh, trying to get my butt out of bed. It was a lot, but my goal was to get to 70. I'm only six figures away from that, so I guess that's not too bad at all. How I'm feeling right now, I'm actually feeling pretty good. I thought this challenge would tire me out, but I'm actually really enjoying it. I was not expecting that at all, but I really love drawing people and I love drawing people well and I love everything that I'm learning from this. I'm definitely getting better at turning form around, like the arms. I'm getting ready, or not getting ready, but getting better at just figuring out how to turn these arms in space and getting a little bit better at foreshortening. and also simplifying shapes. I've always struggled with like legs and feet and hands and I'm getting a lot better at just being like intuitively drawing in those shapes better I guess. Y'all give me a break it's uh I'm tired. <laughs> Words are not wording right now.
it is day two of this, I'm on figure 64 and I want to get to figure 85 tonight so that I only have 15 to do tomorrow morning because tomorrow morning is the, that's going to be my last chance I'm going to be able to do this because I'm just going to be like way too busy here at the end of the week and over the weekend. Yeah, I'm stressed, but hey, it isn't a, it isn't called a challenge for nothing, seriously. Sorry I'm not the most aesthetically pleasing right now, but like I said, man, this is a challenge. Ain't no time for aesthetics. We got some work to do. I like to be educated, but I'm so frustrated. To my loneliness I guess that ignorance is bliss Take me back to before the new Rewind, take it out of cue Innocence can be a young man's game Signed up for the Hall of Shame I wish I knew How much I miss All right, just got done with figure 85. It's 10.30 and I have to get up early tomorrow. <laughs> oh, that's okay though. I'm tired. Interestingly enough, I feel like the longer I go, the worse my figures get. Probably because I am so tired. I just wasn't really, that wasn't something I was expecting at all, but um, yeah, I'm on track to finish this tomorrow. I only have 15 more figures to go. I can't believe I've literally drawn, what, 70 figures in, I guess, three days. I started this last night. I did it this morning, again tonight. And then tomorrow morning will be the last day, so yeah, it's kind of crazy.
and that is the 100 figure challenge yay i am so proud of myself for finishing this mostly because that's 70 figures in three-ish days and yeah i just want to say thank you so much for watching thank you so much for joining me on this journey how am i feeling right now definitely tired a little fatigued but also extremely proud because I didn't think that I could do this. I didn't think I had it in me. And the moment when I thought, hey, I really need to finish this challenge. Could I do it in a couple days? And I was doing the mental math to figure out how much time I need to spend on each figure to get it done. Yeah, I was really hesitant. I didn't, like I said, I didn't know if I could do it or not. So this challenge taught me that I'm capable of way more than I thought. It makes me really excited to do more challenges in the future. I will have to recover first because I don't want to get burnt out. And this week has been very, very busy. So, yes, thank you so, so much for watching. If you liked this video and want to see more challenges in the video, please let me know. I want to do more 100 of whatever kind of challenge, so I'm thinking like something something like a 100 hands challenge. I'll probably do the 100 faces challenge because now I feel like I need to do it. Another idea I've had is 100 mini canvases. That's, that's going to be a commitment for sure. That will be a challenge, but I really want to do it. So yeah, again, thank you so much for watching and have a great day. I like to be educated, but I'm so frustrated. Hello to my loneliness. I guess that ignorance is bliss.